As Massachusetts voters head to the polls next month, one question up for consideration is the repeal of a controversial law that allows people without proper U.S. citizenship to apply for a driver's license starting on July 1st of 2023. As long as they can prove to the Registry of Motor Vehicles that they have a foreign passport or another form of identification. The bill was passed this year over Governor Charlie Baker's veto, although controversy over this bill has persisted. In a letter to lawmakers, Baker argued that this law would, quote, increase the risk that non-citizens would be registered to vote. We talked to people on both sides of the issue to better understand how this bill would impact the community. We want to make sure that all drivers in Massachusetts are trained, licensed, and insured. Um, and so that means it doesn't matter what your immigration status is, you should still pay the same RMV fees. You should, all, you should have insurance. You should pass a test just like everybody else um, has to pass their test. It means that people um, without federal immigration status can be able to get to work, take their kids to school, take their kids to the doctor, just to be able to get around. It's just, it's just, you know, taking care of our fellow humans, right? And treating everybody with dignity um, that people aren't, uh, we have so many of our neighbors who are out there driving in fear. They have to take their kids to the doctor or at, at a cost of, um, uh, being caught driving without a license, which is a crime, which could, by the way, lead to deportation, which means separating from their children. So how does that make any sense that somebody driving their kid to school could lead to deportation? That doesn't make any sense. Law enforcement um, very much supports this law because they want to make sure the person um, behind the wheel is the person that they say they're, they are. And so the biggest thing is to share this information that there is a question for, and we're asking people to vote yes on four for safer roads and to help take care of our neighbors. The impact of this bill, if it's allowed to go into effect uh, in July, is, um, you know, the RMV is going to be responsible for validating the foreign documents that are brought to them uh, by the illegal immigrants. Uh, this is the RMV that's been riddled with many scandals over the last few years. Uh, Charlie, Governor Charlie Baker vetoed this bill because he had concerns about the RMV's uh, ability to uh, validate these documents. Um, and there's a big concern about election integrity and these uh, people being registered to vote and then you know, them affecting our election results. You can find question four on the ballot during the election on November 8th. Thanks for watching.